Hey guys, I welcome you all to my YouTube channel Gardening Paradise and hope you all would be doing great. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to start coxcomb plant from seeds. But before that, if you're new to this channel or yet not have subscribed to it, then I request you to please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon afterwards so that you'll get the first time notification whenever I upload a new video. So first, we should discuss a basic requirement for germinating these seeds. So the ideal temperature range for successful germination of coxcomb seed is in between uh, 21 degrees Celsius to 25 degrees Celsius or uh, 70 degree Fahrenheit to 77 degree Fahrenheit. So when we talk about uh, light conditions, so these seeds require darkness. Uh, so you should cover them uh, with a potting mix and may even uh, cover the pot uh, with either the newspaper or any dark color plastic sheet as well. Depending upon the climatic and uh, germinating conditions, the seed will take anything in between 7 to 10 days to sprout. So this uh, potting mix, it has uh, two parts of garden soil, one part compost, one part cocoa peat, one part sand and very little amount of uh, perlite and vermiculite. So this clay pot I'm going to use, it already has a hole. Uh, I just cover the hole uh, with any pebble. Now just fill the potting, potting mix I prepared in it. When the pot is half full, gently compress the soil uh, with help of any tool uh, to remove any sort of air pockets. Now again fill uh, the potting mix in it. Give the pot a little shake uh, to let the soil settle down. So these are the coxcomb seeds. You can also purchase these seeds at a very low. Already made a video regarding that. Uh, we'll provide the link of the same video and we'll share the contact details of the seller in the description as well. Now just spread these seeds on the top of the soil. Cover these seeds uh, with a very thin layer of the same potting mix. Sprinkle some water on it. As seeds require darkness to germinate, so you can place this pot at a shaded location. Uh, so this is the result after 8 days, uh, so you can see all uh, almost all the seeds have germinated. So now I'll place these seeds uh, at a well lit area where the pot uh, may have access to at least couple of hours of uh, sunlight, preferably in the morning time. This is the result after 20 more days. Uh, as you can see all uh, the plants have grown well. So now it's right time to uh, transplant them. So I'm going to use this uh, 8 inch plastic pot and going to use the same uh, potting mix which I've uh, prepared earlier. Now just fill the potting mix in it. Give the pot a little shake. With the help of any tool, carefully take out the seedling. Now place the seedling in the center and fill in some more potting mix. Sprinkle some water. Now place this pot at a partial shaded location for at least couple of days and gradually move it out to full sun. As I've already added a good amount of fertilizer in the mix itself and being the summer season uh, when the temperature here is more than 40 degrees Celsius, so the plant won't require much of extra fertilizer. But if you may notice any deficiency in plant's health, then you may apply a little amount of fertilizer at an interval of 20 to 25 days. This is the result after 20 more days. Uh, this is one of the many seedlings I have grown and uh, planted in a 10 inch pot. So plant is blooming with a very beautiful flower and uh, lots of blooms are coming up. So 
so i hope you must have enjoyed this video please uh, share this video to as many people as you can with like this video write comments if you have any thanks for watching happy gardening